Alright friends, welcome back to another video on Laravel and Liveware. Recently I was exploring Liveware and Tailwind CSS by building this little project. And on this project there is one section called people you may know. And over here there is one little icon to refresh the list of the users that I may know. So first of all let me give you the demo of what we are gonna build on this video. So over here if I click on this icon you will see this list got refreshed and you will also see that little animations let me show you once again yeah this is animating and the list is refreshed and we haven't refreshed the page anymore we are just refreshing this specific section see how cool this is and i haven't written any javascript to do this all this is done through liveware and over here i can follow this specific user and if i refresh the list again then that followed user will be disappeared i can follow another user i can unfollow the same user all this is done through liveware so in this specific video i'm gonna show you how we can refresh this list by clicking this icon over here so let's get started okay i'll be showing you three different ways of handling this and finally we'll stick with the one that fits our needs so let's dive into the code so first of all we need to listen for the click event on that icon right so we need to listen for the click event over here so let's do that so to do that let me go over here and let's do wire click and on click we'll be calling the method let's say refresh okay so let me go back to the component and over here let me create that method called refresh and on this method we'll not be doing anything so we'll just return nothing okay and let me go back to the browser refresh the page and click on it and you see that this got refreshed let me click it once again to show you and it got refreshed see how this works so let me explain you and on this refresh method we are just returning nothing and liveware automatically re-render this component so this is getting refreshed see how cool this is now let's add animations over here when someone click this little icon right we want to rotate this icon so let's do that so to do that let's go to pull you may know the letter psv file and over here let's do wire dot target and we want to target this specific action called refresh right and then we will be doing wire loading dot class calls to animate speed and while we are sending the ajax request to the server we'll be adding this class called animate spin which is specific to tailwind css so it will be rotating so let me show you that let me refresh it and then click over here and this icon got animated see how cool this is but let me show you one issue over here uh, now if i click on follow this user specific user let me follow this and that user got disappeared but actually we don't want to make that happen we want something like when someone click on this follow button it get followed and when someone click next time then it will return back to this state as you have noticed on the demo that i have shown previously now let me show you another way of refreshing this list so let's try another way which is the second one so over here we are calling the refresh method right so let me go back to the people you may know company class and on this refresh method we are just returning nothing so instead of doing that we can simply remove it from here and we can use liveware magic method called dollar refresh and now let me save this go back to the browser and if i click on refresh and it got refreshed right see how cool this is but here is the same issue as well so let me click on follow then this will get disappeared but actually we don't want to make that happen and it do not fit our actual need so let's try the final one 
so let me go back to the code editor and then over here let me go to peculiar menu component class and over here let me do die and dump here so to show you let me save this now if we click on refresh we'll be calling that render method right because library will automatically call that render method so if we call again we are calling that render method right and on that render method we have this functionality called user and then suggested people which will return the random users but we don't want to put this code over here so let me move this code to another method so let me create another method let's say refresh users okay and on refresh users uh, let me move this remove it from here and put it over here now if i refresh the page it will get broken right we'll get the issue so we need to pass users to our view right so for passing users we can simply use uh, the mount method and on that mount method we can simply call refresh refresh users method right and on refresh users we are setting this property so now let me save this refresh it again let me click over here but it will not work right actually we need to call this method so let me copy this go back and then instead of refresh let me remove it from here and let's call this method called refresh users let me refresh the page and now once i click over here and it get refreshed now if i follow this specific user yep it get followed but it didn't got removed which is fine and we can unfollow this user as well this can be very useful when someone follow a specific user accidentally and then they may want to unfollow them and everything is working perfectly fine so this was for this video i hope you learned something from this video and finally if you are interested on this project source code and want to support this channel then i have kept the link under the descriptions from where you can purchase this project source code so till then have a great time and i will see you on the next video